really is. There's something magical about walking through Iroquois Park in general, but then when it's lit up with thousands of jack-o'-lanterns. Oh, it's beautiful. So we're looking at this year's jack-o'-lantern spectacular um, pre presented by Thornton's and we are talking about probably better than the years past. I've got Brooke here um, with the Parks Alliance. Listen, I mean, it, does it just keep getting better? It really does. It's every year. I don't understand how it is that the team of artists and the production company outdo themselves, but they certainly manage to. We're flipping off the lights and giving people a good look. So this is the start of the trail. This is the entrance to the trail. Um, you can see up ahead the um, sign. Our theme this year is changing the channel, a timeline of television history. What does that mean exactly? What are we going to see? Uh, so we'll start off with the golden age of television. I love Lucy, uh, Dick Van Dyke, those fun shows move into the I Dream of Jeannie and, oh. um, and then take you all the way through what we do today. We can stream Netflix on our cell phones, right? Yeah. So it really does, the whole show runs the gamut of, of television. I love the... Um, the, the signage it will is depicting what TVs look like yeah. uh, during those eras and, and uh, the soundtrack of our lives, all the theme songs from our favorite TV shows. People are going to be bobbing their heads walking <laughs> through here. And that's another big thing. It's what we're back to walking this year. There's something really cool about that versus being in a car. You know, it is such an uh, being on the trail is such an immersive experience. When you're in your car, you're still sort of in real life because it's your car. When you're walking the woods at Iroquois Park, completely surrounded by the lights and sounds and artistry of the show, it is like nothing else. It really is. And tickets um, are ranged from 12 to $20, depending on kids, adults, week, weekends. But it all does kick off tonight. And guys, I just have to say, um, looking at all of these pumpkin faces, I don't think in my like years of doing this, I can spot one that is like the other. They're all so different and so fun to look at. And like Erica said, it, seeing it on TV or seeing it in a photograph does not do no. this justice.